everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Feebri. On today's video, I am here on Berry Avenue because there has been a new update and this update includes a new gas station building, a new Mediterranean bungalow, a new modern Mediterranean house, a new loading screen as you guys can see. It looks so cute. It's like little Polaroids on the screen. So we have a Polaroid which says all the update logs. And then we have these cute little photos. It's like me and Amber, where you can get your coffee with friends in the cafe. And then we have myself, Amber, Poppy and Josh, where we're eating good food. I think it's just so cute. But anyway, let's get straight into the game so you can see what the update looks like. Okay, so here I am on Berry Avenue. Let's go ahead and get myself a car out so we can go to the gas station. Um, I'm gonna get this one because this one's really cute. Also, as you guys can see, my bump is huge. Look at this. It's enormous. I am ready to pop anytime. I'm just waiting for the baby girl to arrive. Hopefully anytime soon. I mean, hopefully not whilst I'm at the gas station. That is not a good place that I want to give birth. But anyway, let's go ahead and drive over. So we go past the bakery and take a right. As you guys can see, we have a gas station now, which is so cool for role plays. So it's like right next to the grocery store, which is usually where gas stations are anyway. So... Let me go ahead and park my car over here. Hey, beautiful. And then we're going to grab one of these pumps. Okay, I got mine. Then we're just going to start fueling the car. Okay, I think that should be enough. Put this back. All right, beautiful. And then it's all filled up. And I'm going to go ahead and just pay over here. There we go. Just use my card. Okay, perfect. And back in my car we go. So there we go. Gas station. We can finally like fuel your car, which is so cool, especially for role plays. And over here, if you have like an electric car, which I think there is an electric car on here. Yes, if we get this Tesla car out or a Porsche, actually, I think this one is, you can go ahead and have it here because it's like an electric charging one. So there you go. You can charge your car whilst you go to the grocery and do some food shopping. Yeah, I love how this looks now. So you have the electric charging for your electric cars. We also had the normal gas station. I think it looks so cool. You can't actually go inside these buildings. This is just there, you know, just to look like a gas station, but you can go to the ATM and you can actually use the pumps, which is super cool. I was trying to do this. I can see how far you can go, but then it gets rid of it. So I was trying to see like, will it pull me back? But I mean, that means you have to park your car somewhat close. Because if it's not close enough, the pump will not reach it. But anyway, this is the gas station. I love how it looks. I think it's so cool. It really adds a realistic element to the game. So I'm glad this has finally been added to Berry Avenue. Now, next up, we have some new houses, which I'm so excited about because I love when there are new houses. So let's get into my car, which has just been charged. I'm going to go ahead and drive to where the houses are. So take a right over here. Okay, we're gonna look at this plot right here. So let's go ahead and go to the for sale sign and see the new houses. So here we go. This is the Mediterranean bungalow. So let's go ahead and click on that and load it. Ooh, very nice. Let's go ahead and just put my car near the driveway. Hey, beautiful. Let's look at the garage, see how much space is in there. Ooh, very nice. Oh, I love that there's a door like here as well. This door just leads outwards. Very nice. I like that. And then we also have a door which leads inside the house. But we're going to use the front door. So these are the front doors. We have two beautiful like French doors. I love how those look. Ooh, open room. I like how this looks. So you have the kitchen right on the left over here. Very nice. Oh, and this is where the door is leading to the garage. And you also have the utility room in here too. Okay, very nice. I like that. And then opposite, we have like a little dining table. I like how this looks very cozy. And then we have the living room right here. And then in here, we have a nice office. Oh, I love the color of this wall. This is nice. Every time there's a new house on Berry Avenue, I just want to move. And I have to control myself because I love my house. But every time there's a new house, I just want to move in here. I mean, look. It's so pretty. Okay, and then what's in here? Okay, in here we have... Oh, we have a nice double bedroom. Very nice. Let's come with an ensuite. Oh, yes, it does. Oh, and a walk-in wardrobe. Wait, two? Oh my gosh, beautiful. Both for me. 
Then we have this gorgeous large bathroom. We have a toilet. We have a sink. We have a gorgeous bath where I can just chill out. And we also have a really nice walk-in shower too. So yeah, I like how this looks. This is really nice. Oh, you can also see the garden outside. There's like a trampoline out there. Oh, wait, these are doors. Oh, sliding doors. I like. So you can go out here just from the bedroom and go straight into the garden onto the trampoline. And then these are also sliding doors, I think. Oh, very nice. I love the sliding doors. And then we also just have a nice little sit down area where you can just sit outside. Just chillax. Oh, and like also a little barbecue area too. Oh, this is nice. Okay, let's see if there's anything else on the right side of this house. Okay, so what's over here? We have two doors. We'll see what this door is first. Oh, this is another bedroom. Oh, there's a cactus in here. That is a new plant. This is a nice bed. Does this also come with an ensuite? Oh, it does. Very nice. And then over here, what's in this room? Oh, another bed. This is a three bedroom house. This is a nice bungalow. And then we also have an ensuite in here too. Oh, wait, what's here? Oh, and this goes straight to the garden. This is cool. And then obviously, if you wanted to add some baby furniture, then you can. So let's see, where is the baby furniture? It might be in the other bedroom. But as you guys can see, we have the little baby chair here. We also have one of these. Oh, I cannot sit on this. Come on. Let me sit down. I've got a baby in my belly. Does that not count? Okay, what about in here? Oh, yeah. There we go. We have the little crib right here. Really, really cute. And then also the changing table. But yeah, this is the Mediterranean bungalow. I love how this looks. I think it's really, really, really nice. But yeah, I would recommend this house. I think it's beautiful. And then next up, we have a Mediterranean mansion. So let's go ahead and switch over our houses and see what this one looks like. So this is it right here. It is so cool, guys. It is like a villa. I love it. Okay, so here we go. Look at this. Look how cool this is. I want to move into this house. I love it. It's gorgeous. But anyway, this is what the house looks like from the outside. It is so cool. I mean, look at this. It has three garage doors. Look at the garden. I mean, this is just awesome. But anyway, let's go ahead and go inside and see what it looks like. So these are the two front doors. Okay, let's open up these beautiful doors. Oh, and look at this. So you have a hallway straight away where you can just see the stairs. And then to the right, we just have a nice little lounge area. I love all the windows. It's very open. I can be nosy at all my neighbors from like every angle, which I love. And then if we go to the left, this is where we have the front room, the living room. We have the TV. We have these really nice like modern couches, which look so nice to take a nap on. You also have the baby furniture, which is out here as well. Then this is like an open plan because we also have the large kitchen area, which looks so nice. Look at this. I really want to move into this house. Guys, tell me, should I or should I not? I mean, I just love how this one looks already. Look, nice little seating area. Also like a larger dining table. So if it's Christmas time, I can invite the whole family over. And then we also have this leading to the garden. And it just looks so nice. Look at this. So much space. And then through these doors over here, let's see what's in here. So we have just a little bathroom in here. Just go to the toilet, wash your hands. And then in here... Oh, we have a downstairs bedroom. And I love the color of this wall. That's a nice blue. Oh, and you can also see the garden. Wait, this is like a private garden. Oh, luxurious. So we have a walk-in wardrobe over here. And then over here, let's have a look. How do I get out of here? Let me in. I want to go to the hot tub. Oh, and then we have a nice ensuite over here. We have a private area to go to the toilet. Very nice. Oh my gosh, here are the doors. Oh my gosh, I have my own hot tub. I love hot tubs. But look at this lovely area. So Josh and I can just sit out here in the morning, have a nice coffee away from all of the kids. See, sometimes I need, I just need a break. And look how nice it is. I get my own little private garden. Wait, is this a door? Let me see. Oh, it is. It's the door that also leads to this garden. Oh, that's so cool. I really love the design of this house. So this is it for the downstairs bedroom. And then if we go on the other side of the kitchen, we should have like the utilities room. Yes. 
So you have like all the storage in here. We have the utility room with like the washing up. Very nice. And then in here, we also have the garage. So this is actually different from the other houses because usually the garages face this way. But this time we actually have the garages facing the other way. So if we open these up, as you can see, you actually park your car at the back. But I really like how that looks. I think it's super cool. So let's get back inside the house and see what upstairs looks like. I'm hoping there's enough bedrooms for my whole family because I do actually want to move in. Oh, look how many windows there are. I just love all the windows. Okay, so when we come upstairs, we have carpet in the hallway. And then on our left, we have a lovely balcony. So I can sit here and have my coffee. Oh, this is so relaxing. This really is a villa. This could be actually, maybe it's gonna be my vacation house. Maybe I can have it as that instead. And then we have an office upstairs, which is perfect for me because actually at the moment I am working from home. And then if we continue down, let's see what else there is. We have another door here. Oh, which is a baby's room. Oh, this is cute. It could be like Buddy's room. And look at the little giraffe shell. That is so cute. Then we have the changing table. You can see outside the front. It's a nice view. And then we have two more doors. So on the right, we have... Oh, we have a little kid's bedroom. This could be like Poppy's bedroom. Oh, and they're like strawberries. That is so cute. And then in here, she also has... Oh, a nice shared bathroom. I love that. This is actually a really, really nice bedroom. I think Poppy would like this a lot. And then opposite, we have just a normal bedroom in here. Oh my gosh, and it also comes with a balcony. Oh, could this house get any bell? And then this is also connected to the bathroom. So that way, you know, Poppy and I can share, use a toilet. And I can also just walk into her bedroom and take a nice nap. But yeah, I love this house. I think it's really, really cute. I think I would just need to add like another crib and then I'd have enough space for like all of the kids. Cause see, this would be like Buddy's room. And then I have Poppy's room in there. And then, I don't know, maybe I could transform this into a baby room. We'll see what happens, who knows? But so far, I really, really like this house and I love how the other house looks as well. But that is it for the update. We looked at the gas station. We looked at the two new houses and the loading screen and they look so cool. I hope you guys really like this update. I think it's super awesome. I'm in love with this house. I really want to move in here. Um, but I'm trying to control myself because right now I've got a lot going on, okay? I've got a baby coming. I don't have time to move houses. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like the video if you did. Also, subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet already. Let me know some updates you would like to see next on Barry Avenue. And I may just tell Amber and Josh. And hopefully they can bring them in the next update. But yeah, I love you all so much. And I'll see you all next time. Bye!